Hi folks, well, video which is more or less a PS because I forgot to put this in my last video. Not a lot, but it's what I've had since the last video and that's this. If you have a look, three safety pins and at the moment you can feel them there little bit raised up a little bit of a scab or whatever you call it on it still a few days that shall work its way off so it's not very easy to see but to give you an idea here's the picture the tattooist I said to him this is what I want showed him a picture and actually what he did he went away drawing it i thought don't even want the flipping picture like because it's on my phone um but he come back with better than i actually gave to him here's the picture he drew and here's the transfer that put it upon my arm and you can't see it there like I said you can't see it there yet because it's still risen up a little bit and a, a bit red but if you look at the picture <coughs> I don't know if you can I don't know if you can actually see it no I don't know if you can see it on there but here you can actually see it that in certain places there's little tiny lines of dots and whatever and they are little areas where um said to him can you do shadow so that they really stand out like 3d and that and uh there's certain places in the the pins and whatever that is put shadow and whatever uh so they do stand out and just there on the pins where it actually goes through the skin there's little red bits where it's still red raw where the pin's gone through so i can't show you what the end product is going to be like at the moment uh, but what i can do is i will put a picture up now otherwise i'll bloody forget this is a picture of when it was just finished which will give you a little bit of an idea what it will look like at the end when it all settles down but i'm assuming it will look even better than it does in this picture because that's when the skin's starting to get a bit red and everything so if you have a look this is what it looked like So there you go that's what it looks like well that's what it looked like now it's looking like that hopefully it'll look like that with a little bit of an improvement but so why did i have pins put on my arm two reasons really because i thought to myself i want something there i want something that goes through the skin and I did think of pins and I thought of probably little uh, thin type dagger type things that were going to go in the skin there and out there whatever settled in the end for pins that was one reason the second reason is that in the UK we had the referendum for Brexit and coming up to the referendum there was all sorts of crap being thrown around and as soon as it started off <coughs> somehow it got out there that if you was for brexit you was racist and you was this and you was thick as shit and you didn't understand anything and whatever and it came in right at the beginning by people in brussels and the odd ones in 
parliament and whatever that really didn't want us to go out because it's lying in their freaking pockets um, and all this stuff started coming up at the same time we did get some of the nastiness of the UK start raising its head it seems to be a thing of the modern world now uh, it's happening in America at the moment it started happening here neo-nazis and racists and all that sort of bloody things started coming out and yeah we want out because we can bloody throw them out and we can do this and all that sort of bloody thing which wasn't what it was all about um, it was about so many different bloody things for me the main one that the European Union just like a bloody dictatorship anyway that's neither here nor there but excuse me <coughs> this started coming out and people wanted to show their support for people in minorities uh, refugees immigrants if you was a person of color if you was uh, whatever you were whether you had a certain illnesses that made you stand there uh, whether you belonged to subcultures whether you was goth hippie biker whatever um, this came out as a symbol and it was to show that you were safe so safety pin could be on your lapel it could be on your dresser or whatever you could put it on an handbag you could put it on a t-shirt tie whatever but the safety pin if people knew about it if they saw you with a safety pin like that it meant i am safe i'm not going to kick off i'm not going to start bloody acting like a complete dickhead i'm not going to be bloody swearing at you and bloody accusing you of stuff and like in america i'm not going to get on the freaking telephone and ring the police and say this person is walking down the bloody pavement you know there's something wrong about that <laughs> And if you was of any colour, you was an immigrant, you was a ref, uh, that was the bloody word. Um, if you was any of these, that you weren't going to kick off with these people that didn't have to be afraid of you. And it's a symbol that shows that, a uh, small symbol, look, I'm okay, I'm not gonna, what's it? So that is secondly as well part to do with that uh, the safety pin symbol to say hey I'm your friend I'll, I'll get on with you, you okay with me I'm, I'm okay with you. So yep new tattoo well new three tattoos belong to one so I'm looking forward to that dying back down and looking as it should do but like i said um the picture looks pretty good that should look pretty good once it it goes back down so just uh, as a ps just to Show you that's something new since the last time. So there you go. Safe. Be safe. Help others to be safe. You see other people being mouthed at or whatever, step up for them. And help your fellow human beings. So have fun. My old saying, don't do anything I wouldn't do. Don't let people like that.
Sie leiden.